it still feels great. I'm very fulfilled and happy and, and joyful to, to be holding this trophy again. Untouchable. In Montreal, there was second big title that I won. I remember I won against both Feather and Adult. Yeah, so try again, it's not like a vitamin. 20 years old and uh, being able to win against top two players in the world in the same tournament was, uh, was a huge achievement that uh, gave me obviously wings for, for the rest of my career. Novak, you must be full of confidence right now. Yes, I am. I got that uh, 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 confidence, that's right. Oh, yes! <laughs> Finish it. And I understand I won my first Grand Slam in 2008 in the Australian Open. But it's a career-defining moment. We can't quite believe it. And then I uh, haven't won any Grand Slam till 2011. He's done it! Victory for Djokovic! By far stands out as the most exciting tennis match I ever played in my life. I mean, playing almost six hours in a Grand Slam final against the top rival. It's you know one of these moments that you will remember forever, that you will cherish forever. There is so much that I can do. I think still, there is so much to prove. I, I want to keep on winning and try to win more Grand Slams. What an achievement for the Serbian superstar. The last five, six years has been an incredible ride and to be able to reach this stage where I can possibly make history is absolutely amazing. He's been able to raise the level of his game to win the major championships. Set up your, your best form for the, for the big ones and that's what I was trying to do in the last five or six years and uh, it's been working well for me. As he prepares, he serves down the tee. And I feel like I, I'm reaching the peak of my of my mental and physical emotional abilities. There's a forehand from the serve. Oh, Nadal's hit it long, and Djokovic wins. It's an utterly dominating win, and he stands above all others at the Australian Open and wins for a seventh time. I had time to reflect on everything that uh, was done in Australia and lots of positives to, to carry into the rest of the season. Australian Open Courts, Melbourne Park was always very suitable to my game. That's probably my most successful court in my career, in my life, so I, I love playing there. Wide from team! This place is known as Rodney Marina, but this court belongs to Novak Djokovic! Everyone has their own journey and their own way of making history. Another title for the world's best. I'm trying to, to build that and develop that myself in a very unique, authentic way that is suitable to me. Novak, congratulations. What does number nine mean to you? I try to remind myself of how important this is and you know, enjoy it as much as I can. Coming to Australia, it always brings that extra dose of confidence to me because of my record here and because of the, how I play in Australia.